doing a demonstration of the Raspberry Pi CCTV camera using uh, infrared motion detection. Um, so first of all what I'll do is I'll put my hand in front of the camera and I'll demonstrate that it detects infrared motion detection and the uh, sounder on the, the device will make a sound to show that it's um, been detected. Like that. And uh, then in the web interface um, I can refresh the page and it shows updating of the recording. Um, currently just got um, my mobile phone in front of the camera so each time I update you can see the updated image through the web interface and you can see it start when it started recording. And it will record for a few minutes and uh, then stop if it doesn't detect any infrared movement again but if it does detect more infrared movement then it will keep recording and from the last bit of infrared movement it detected it will record something like a minute I think. And finally to demonstrate um, the interface from a laptop for the CCTV cameras um, I'll get the, a copy of the latest video which we recorded when I triggered the infrared um, detection so first of all I can do a listing of the video files for that particular CV, CCTV camera with CCTV LS and then the uh, IP address of the camera and so at the bottom you can see the motion log which did, which um, keeps a log of all the trigger events uh, and then just above that that's the latest uh, file so they should be in uh, uh, increasing um, chronological order and in order to get, get that video file I can do a CCTV get then the IP address of the camera and then the video file name I'll just wait for this to download it shouldn't take long it is recorded in res relatively high resolution um, and that appears over here in this directory I open it up and so that's the video from when I triggered the CCTV camera